Welcome back. This uh, segment brought to you by Republic National Distributing Company. If it's fun, we're doing it right. And this segment, all about BurgerFi. Wow. And we're so pleased to be joined uh, today uh, by Avatar Ohar, who's the Assistant Training Team Leader for BurgerFi. Welcome. Hey, Thank good you. to see you. Good to see you, My too. daughter's 17-year-old twin daughters, and they always say the favorite burger, the best burger in South Florida, is BurgerFi. Awesome. So Perfect. they're excited that, that, that you're here Great. today. Great. And I'm glad to be here. I'm glad you guys can have us. I haven't actually been to Miami in about four years since I graduated, graduated in Johnson Wales, North Miami. Johnson Wales, great. Uh, hey. 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 That's our uh, unadopted uh, official university. Jimmy has an honorary doctorate there. There oh, you go. Awesome. And Brenda worked there for 13 years. We're yeah. excited about that. Um, there's so many options when you go to BurgerFi. And it's one of the things I love about it. You're going to make the veggie burger? Yes. So uh, you, you guys are going to help me make the veggie burger okay. here today. I'm going to show you how, okay. um, what the greens are and how we actually go through the process in our stores so you, you know, our viewers can make it at home. Okay. Um, awesome. it's, it's all the ingredients that we have. It's proprietary to us. Uh, and you guys are, the, the, the website, I believe the recipe is going to be on the website. Yes, right? it is. All right. And there's a lot of ingredients. Uh, yes, yeah, 14 ingredients, by. all completely house made every just about two or three days. Okay. Just, so it's it's very, very fresh whenever you come to a restaurant. What's the premise of a veggie burger? It's more than just vegetables. It's also grains to be able to provide Correct. everything? Correct. It's, it's, uh, it's hearty grains like quinoa, lentils with fresh vegetables and cheeses. So it's not vegan, but it's a, it's a more vegetarian option. Right. We do have the Beyond Burger, which you guys covered last time. That's right, right. That's completely, right. Ve That's completely vegan. vegan. Right. right, exactly. And what's the binding agent to this? The binding is our, the, the, so the Parmesan, the Fontina, and, and uh, a couple eggs. A couple eggs, too. All right. Yeah. How do we right. start? this process. It doesn't matter which way you decide to do it. It's kind of. It actually, it it's, it's, it's actually a, a very, very specific. Layered type la thing. Exactly. Okay. Layered type of um, uh, maneuver that we do. So uh, just follow along with me. We actually okay. do the uh, zucchinis first, right? Okay. Right. So Does you want to layer the zucchinis in your container, whatever there may be. Then your lentils. So you always want to have a grain or a vegetable and alternate as you go up. Okay. So that way it's already like pre-mixed as you go along. Right. Then you want to take your another vegetable, so your mushrooms. Are these all cooked now that you cooked them pr prior to? Correct. Right. We, ab we absolutely have. Both the zucchini and the mushrooms. Correct. The next we want to take our quinoa. Quinoa is just cooked like rice. Um, so you're going to do the two to one ratio as well. Same thing with lentils. Lentils is just cooked like pasta. So okay. a little al dente. So a little al dente. Okay. That way when you're actually cooking it on the stove or whether it's in the fryer, yeah. it doesn't fall apart, you know. And we're talking about two to one. Two to one grain to vegetable? Uh, no, two to one water. Water. So with the actual grain. Okay, got it. All right. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Exactly. Got it, got so it. next we put our carrots in here. All right. Then we actually want to use one of our binders at this point. So now we have our Fontina cheese that goes inside. It doesn't matter if you say, I don't like Fontina, but I want to use You can mozzarella, use any, any yeah, mozzarella. exactly. Mozzarella, cheddar, pepper jack, any other kind that you want to you, you know, utilize at home. And that was an onion, correct? These are onions. Right. Now, okay. the, spe the special thing about these onions is that it's caramelized very, very deeply, right? Okay. So we get that, uh, we call it GBD in the industry. So golden brown delicious, right? Right. And then we put our, we deglaze the pan on the bottom, red wine. A lot of people at home tend to throw away the, you know, the remnants of the pan, they're like, oh, I'm just going to, you know, wash that away. That's actually a really good flavor. So we use the wine to deglaze and get all that stuff off of it. Got it. Then we put some thyme right at the end, fresh thyme, so it's that ar aromatic type Ooh. of feel and flavor in there. Okay. I know, I know, I know. See, it looks delicious already. Right. <laughs> Parmesan cheese. Parmesan cheese goes in. Then our salt and pepper right on top. Now the last thing, so these two, we have our panko and we have our egg. So we want to add these two fairly quickly. What's going to happen is your panko is going on top. And then you have that dry area, and then once the egg hits it, it becomes kind of like a, a sand, a sand kind of consistency, and that's what you want to mix in. Okay. So as we pour it, mix it just a little bit quick, and fold everything in. Okay. So as we're folding it in, it starts to fully incorporate. It is this enough for one burger? Yeah, this is only specifically for one burger. Okay. Uh, we tend to do this on a very large scale, <laughs> uh, almost like 300 or 400 burgers at a time hey. per store. Our uh, One store to highlight is our West Del Rey store. They do tons of these. Their clientele there loves these un unbelievably. All right, so there we go. We have our mix yeah. pretty much well incorporated right there. And now we actually take them and we make them into our patty. So we're going to make our grilled veggie right now and we actually have a fried variety that we have in uh with the magic of uh magic tv, TV. Right. we're gonna pull them out of the oven okay. so the grilled is about four inches across there we go that's what we want right 
Nice size burger. And then we're going to place it right there in the pan. And you have a little bit of oil in there. What Correct. kind of oil do you use? Peanut oil. We only specifically use peanut oil. Peanut oil. Okay. Mm -hmm. Got it. So, all right. So we're almost done with our burger. We're going to set up the green style ways you guys saw last time. All right. And we have some tomato and lettuce here. So on the top is going to be our lettuce and tomato right here. And on the bottom, we'll have one more lettuce bed so we can actually... Oh, that's we your love bun. This. Exactly. That's your bun. love this. So we're, so, cutting that, we're cutting a lot of carbs out of this deal. Exactly. Everyone's trying to, you know, cut carbohydrates at the moment. So that's what we're trying to assist with. Right. This is our kind of uh, gluten-free bun, as you would. All right, so our burger pie sauce actually goes on top and the bottom. All right, right Special here. Special sauce. Special sauce. Mm -hmm. And we're going to put this one right here. Uh, we'll put this right here on top of here, and we're good to go. See, that's a great looking burger, and it's a healthy burger, too. Yeah. Exactly. It really is in so many ways. So you don't have to give up everything you love at BurgerFi. Okay, so is this the potato bun? So this is the potato bun that we have. We have right. our wheat bun here, and this is the last variation, our green stuff. Any variation of our burgers, from CEO or a Beyond Burger to any of them, can actually be Change to any kind of bun that you'd like. Right. That looks absolutely delicious. I like the burger fry. I love that you, it looks like a branding on top of it, which is absolutely delicious. And look, someone, someone's every back there. bit of it has ooey gooeyness to it. Every, every, if someone's back there every single day branding the mm. bun, every, every single day. Right, they, they actually take a branding yep. and boom. Okay. Yeah, all right, let me uh, take a bite of something here. I, I, you know, I'm going to try the green. Because okay. I'm going to try to hold my grillish figures, so I'm going to go green. <laughs> <laughs> no, that, didn't, that, didn't, yeah, that didn't work. Mm. See, it doesn't taste like a veggie bun. No, no. It no. You don't feel like you're missing anything. No, you know? not missing I've had a lot of veggie burgers in my life, and I get not because I work for the company, but it, it's genuinely a very, very good It's brand. delicious. It really is. Thank you so much. I'm so glad oh, now. I know what to order when the girls want burgers. A burger five. I'm glad, I'm glad, I'm glad I could be here to show you guys oh, how I'm so everything was made. I'm excited about oh, it. And, and that soda is delicious. The soda's great. Thank you. We'll be back with more right after this. Thanks so much. Let's go. Much.